I feel like I look like an egg. Guys, I swear to God, if anyone roasts my ear, I don't blame you. Hi guys, so today I'm gonna be filming a video about my weight loss. <laughs> I know I milk this topic so much, but a lot of you requested for a video about that and I did post a video on my old channel, but a whole issue happened with my old channel, so that video is no longer available. Hopefully this is the final weight loss video you guys will see from me. Without further ado, let's let's get on to the video. First things first is food. I feel like food is actually like super obvious. What you eat is literally so fucking important because if you eat like shit and you are expecting to lose weight, it's not gonna happen. Um, the only way to lose weight is, I wouldn't say be in a calorie deficit because I wasn't in a calorie deficit um, back then but it's really important to know what you're eating so i definitely recommend eating at home and cut the fucking outside food i wouldn't say cut it out completely eat like once in a week something you like from out but most importantly is like eating at home because i feel like you really know what's like in your food and i feel like you know it's like a less likely chance that there's some ingredients there that you don't know that could be like stopping you from your weight loss goals i can't fucking speak so i did a lot of volume eating i ate a lot of like broccoli fucked my stomach made me far 24 7 but i ate a lot of broccoli i had a lot of salads i had a lot of spinach i had a lot of lettuce cauliflower so many like vegetables that will actually keep me full for a long time i also had a lot of like protein with each and every dish of mine i mostly had like sea bass fish i remember sea bass fish broccoli and a salad would be like my lunch like that was literally a daily thing and i actually enjoyed it so much i definitely recommend you guys to have like for each and every meal a protein and just volume volume foods if that makes sense um number two is obviously commitment and self-discipline a lot of people ask me like how are you motivated and like honestly i don't know <laughs> you know like it's all in your fucking head like it's literally a war in your head and it's your thoughts that's like no fuck this start tomorrow blah 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 but you just have to like i guess have a positive mindset towards this and when sometimes you feel like giving up just like really like you know fuck with your head go like do i really want to give up it's just your head feeding you some bullshit so definitely have a positive mindset towards this and you know you got this like in the end of the day anyone could fucking lose weight if they wanted to but they just choose to listen to the bad comments in their hand i guess there were a, like a lot of days that i was like no fuck this khalas, khalas, we get it i want mcdonald's but i'm like yeah you could have mcdonald's and just you know go back on track so always have like a balance so it will be more like a lifestyle thing rather than a diet for a short period of time because you will always fucking bounce back but always bounce back if you have this mindset where like okay i'll diet for one month and then after that i'm just gonna eat whatever the fuck i want it's not gonna work like that you have to make it like a lifestyle change and that's why if you're gonna say i'm not gonna have mcdonald's forever it's not fucking realistic have mcdonald's and the next meal just have your normal healthy meal tip number three is working out i did not have an access to a gym like when i was trying to lose the weight so i would literally jog around my compound jog around my area for like an hour or 30 minutes and it was actually really fun it wasn't like sprinting jogging it was literally like such light jogging but i was like you know being somewhat active and you don't need a gym to fucking lose weight because that's cap you could do it at home you can do it around your area you could do it around your compound literally all it takes is 30 minutes of an exercise a day and you will slowly progress towards your goals if that makes sense i dropped out of school so excuse my english I don't know what I'm saying. I really don't know what I'm saying. Oh my god, to all the people that fucking talk for a long period of time, bless you, that takes talent. I don't know how you do it because I stopped this video like literally 20 times because I didn't know what I was saying. But anyways, for the last two tips, um, I would say make it more of a lifestyle change. So don't fucking restrict yourself. Like just don't zone zoom it. Zone zoom it. Um, I used to crave chips so much and I would actually like have chips not all the time like sometimes i just tell my cravings to shut the fuck up and then um just go back on track to my next normal healthy meal um so yeah just 
don't don't restrict yourself and uh, make it more of a lifestyle thing than a temporary thing because that's the only way it's gonna work um yeah second tip is make this a fun journey you know i feel like cooking is so therapeutic so make it like fun you know like if you if you want a cake make a healthy cake if you want pizza make a healthy pizza all the recipes like is all online you could look up whatever the fuck you want make it healthy like it's 2022 everything you want is on the internet so yeah that is it for this video hopefully you guys understood one thing from this video um but yeah thanks a lot for watching thanks a lot rachel um subscribe to my channel and let me know what other videos you guys would like um to see love you